Hey you guys, it's me Morgan. So I decided to give you guys a heads up about life and what I will be doing um, for the next eight weeks. And I'm very excited and nervous, but yes. Okay, so I'm gonna do a transformation challenge. Um, it's called the heat challenge. So um, you guys probably won't know what it is, but basically the gym that I go to, the owner of the gym has a eight week transformation i can never say that word transformation 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 challenge um a couple times a year so he's doing like the spring one right now um it starts april 16th and ends june 14th i think but um basically um it's a challenge for your body and uh, you have your before picture and video and your after. So my favorite part of it besides getting like extra fine is that the winner will get $5,000 like bam, like $5,000. So that's a very good incentive to enter the challenge. Um, it was $149 but I paid 99 because I had a coupon code. So, um i put my hundred dollars in so i'm about to like go extra hard because i really want to win and so yeah the top five people get five thousand dollars each so he's giving away twenty five thousand dollars basically um so this is the guy that owns the gym that i go to he does it it's open to people everywhere in the united states um he sends you like a meal plan like foods you should eat, all the workouts, tips, all that. But I'm going to try to do my own meal plan because I, I don't know, I just want to like say that I made my own meal plan up. So I kind of brought a meal plan based off like knowing my body and what works for me. So I'm going to try that. Um, so yeah, so this video is probably going to go up after the 16th. I didn't think to record it before then. So um, he does have other challenges throughout the year. So this is not the last one. Like he just had a winter one that ended March 16th. So he'll probably have one or two more before the end of the year. So don't worry. But I just wanted to show you guys and ignore my kitchen. Um, it's really messy. But since today is Sunday and the challenge starts Monday. Did I say the challenge started on Sunday? No. The challenge starts Monday april 16th so if y'all follow me on instagram y'all know i love oxtails so yesterday i posted the last supper so i made oxtails one last time they're in here and i just literally put them on the stove this is from yesterday so they're I need a spoon or something they are um being heated up because I actually made a whole lot because I wanted to eat them all weekend because I won't be able to eat oxtails until June again so I made some oxtails and I really wanted to record a video on how I make them but it's just like it's just a long process and I'll try so in the summer I'll try to make a video since I'm off and free and everything so I'm gonna eat my last supper back there I'm so sad uh, but I just want to show you guys what I will be eating for this challenge so I'm gonna pull my food out how cute is let me show you guys how cute is this bag like my mom got me this bag it's so pretty fabulous darling so I want to show you guys what I'll be eating this week, I'm not going to be like cooking. Um, I mean, I'm going to be cooking. I'm not going to be recording what I'm cooking. I'll probably do that next week just because today is so busy. I have to record YouTube videos and I got places I have to go. So, um, for dinner all week, I will be eating cod. I love cod. Um, this is wild caught, so I'm only going to be eating, my arm is tired, I'm only going to be eating wild caught fish, so cod is great and it has 26 grams of protein in it, um, so yeah, I got this at Kroger and it comes in this bag and it's wild caught and they were on sale for $9.99, so I got two bags for this week and next week. 
usually when stuff's on sale i get a lot of it because i'm like especially if it's something i'm gonna use like I'm gonna use it regardless. So let me get all this other stuff out real quick. Okay, so I got the cod. Um, I have the, uh, there's a glare. This is the lean, extra lean um, ground chicken breast. So yeah, it's really, really healthy and really expensive, but the farmer's market is cheaper. But um, yeah, it's 27 grams of protein. Um, I got avocados, organic avocados, pepper, sweet potato, I have lemon juice to put in whatever drink I'm drinking, which is probably water or green tea, uh, asparagus, baby spinach. So at night for dinner, I'm eating cod and baby spinach with balsamic vinaigrette. I'm just pure like that. I know it's going to be disgusting. Um, mint to put in my green tea. I have blueberries. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. I have eggs. I have Mrs. Dash because I can't, I'm not using salt this whole eight weeks, Lord Jesus. Uh, I have oatmeal and then I have my watermelon, which is right here. Y'all know I love watermelon, so I have my watermelon right there. Okay, so I also have my balsamic vinegar. So this is all the stuff that I'll be eating this week. So basically what I'm doing is having a lot of protein. Um, I only picked two fruits, so fruit has sugar in it. So not that many fruits. So the only fruits I have are blueberries right here. And the blueberries go in my oatmeal and I have watermelon. So I wrote down a list of my meal prep. So if it works, I can save it and share it with you guys. But I wanna try it out first. Um, what else? I have a sweet potato. I'm only gonna eat half a sweet potato for lunch with the ground turkey with the peppers and onions in it. And if you guys look at my Sunday cooking vlog, I'm making the same thing for lunch, which is the ground turkey. So yeah. So I'm the type of person, I can eat the same thing every single day. So I'm okay with this. And I'm gonna have tuna as a snack. And I got low sodium. Because if you have a lot of sodium, it like makes you bloat it and all that. That's why I'm not using salt. So this is everything I have over here. So I'm just really excited for this. Um, so I really want to see how my body can transform. And I am booking a trip to some country, some beach after this challenge is over. I really want to go to Jamaica. But I'm booking a trip somewhere because... This is about to be crazy. So please let me know if you would like for me to like record every week, like just throughout the week. Well, I'll upload it once a week or every other week, but I just wanna like track my progress. Actually, I'll probably do it like every other week. Um, so yeah, so right now I weigh one, 57 or 158 this whole week i've been eating bad just so i can like be a little bigger um and get all of it out of me before i like go in at this because i'm about to go in okay like you're about to see some changes okay so um yeah that's about it i'll leave the link to the um challenge like they have an instagram page and a website i'll leave the link to that if you guys are interested i'm sorry i didn't post this before it started um, it starts on Monday the 16th, so I think it's too late to enter because it's probably past the 16th by the time this gets up. But I just want to show you guys my journey and I'll show you my before pictures um, so you guys can see what I'm looking like before and y'all will see. And every week I'll tell you what works and what doesn't work and whatever. But now I'm about to like demolish these oxtails. They're cooking. Well, they're heating up now, so I'm about to show you them because they look better ignore my stove but yeah so here are my oxtails and when I reheat them I like to heat them in the pot and not the microwave on a low temperature because you don't want to burn them 
that's how I messed up last time. Like last time, I made, well not last time, but before I made oxtails, I was so hungry. I just went to heat them up extra quick and they burned and I couldn't even eat them. I was so sad. So um, I made these oxtails from scratch. I will eventually make a video on how I make them. I'm not Jamaican or Caribbean. I just really love oxtails and I've been making them almost, I probably made them like 10 times so far. So I feel like I got it and they taste very good. So yeah, so if you guys have any comments or questions about this like challenge, please let me know. Um, yeah, cause I'm ready. I am ready for this. Let me show you guys what I look like in the mirror first before I start. I did put this mirror up here in the kitchen. Um, so yeah, so this is what I look like now. So this is before the challenge. I'm trying to get abs, okay? So the gym is not the problem. It's my eating that's the problem. So we'll see how it goes. I'm going to weigh myself. One at sixty. All right, so hey you guys, today is day one of the heat challenge and um, I'm just giving you guys an update. So I'm about to eat dinner. First of all, my workout was crazy as heck. I'm so tired. Um, my, one of my nail polishes came off my nails, so sad. But um, today is day one and uh, yeah, my workout was crazy. I burned. <laughs> Um, now my watch is 1,379 calories. So when I got to the gym, I did 30 minutes on the Stairmaster with intervals and I did arms and shoulders and that workout was just crazy. And then I did a mile on the treadmill after. So now I'm home and I'm about to cook my dinner, which is going to be cod and spinach with some balsamic, cannot say that word, balsamic vinegar. So I just want to show you guys my scale because I love my scale and it's like the best scale ever. So um, yeah, I'm about to show it to you. So I need to weigh my food as part of my meal plan. I want to know how much I'm eating. So I have my piece of cod right here. So this scale shows you like the nutrition facts for everything. So what you do is you look through this book that comes with it. And then you look for, my hands like kind of shaking. Um, Cod Pacific Raw 0428. So you type it in, so come on. Keep moving, okay, 0428. All right, so it goes to zero. And then I'm just gonna take my cod and put it on here. So this is so cool because it shows you how much of it you have. So in my meal thing, it says, how much cod do I need? It says I need for dinner. Um, is it gonna focus? Focus or no? All right. So it says zero, I mean, not zero. It says four and three fourths ounce. So I have almost four and three fourths, just a little bit under, but it's so cool because it has how many calories is in this piece of cod. It has how much fat, how many carbs, sodium, cholesterol, protein, all that. So I'm about to eat this piece of cod. Um, this scale is on Amazon and I will link it below if you guys are interested in it. But the book has like tons of stuff on like every, thing and you can put your own stuff in too so it's really really cool tell me why i'm over here cutting my onion and i broke oops, i'm about to break the refrigerator too all right i broke the knife like look how strong i am i broke the knife oh my god cutting wow okay so since i need to eat a lot of protein I'm going to make these egg white muffins and I'm going to attempt to make them. I don't have a recipe. I'm just gonna put some stuff together. So I'm gonna show you guys these real quick. So, um, this is gonna be my breakfast. 
So I usually eat boiled eggs, but I want boiled, boiled eggs as a snack too now. So I'm just going to take, I hope these are egg whites because I didn't even look, but they should be. I'm gonna take a cup. Oh my God, these are not, are these egg whites? No, egg whites are just white, man. Mm. Okay, it says it's processed using egg whites, but why is it this color? It should be clear. Okay, I'm just gonna make these anyway because there's no cholesterol really in them. So, whatever, we're just gonna try this. So I'm going to put a cup in here. I'm so mad. Like, I just wanted the egg whites. I'll get them tomorrow. So I'm going to put a cup in here. Or maybe two. I might as well just use two. Since. I have to use the whole thing. All right. Man, I really. Okay, so these are definitely regular eggs. It's okay. All right, so, and I got some peppers and some spinach and onions. So I'm just going to put all this in here and then I'm going to put them in this pan. And I meant to get another one, but I thought, uh -uh, I thought I had one. So it's going to go like this. And I'm going to add some seasonings to it can't really use salt so i'm just gonna use this table blend from mrs dash since there's no salt in it i'm trying to like lower my salt intake because i love salt and then i'm gonna use this garlic and herb one and you have to use a lot of that stuff because it has no flavor at all like i don't really like mrs dash but whatever and then I'm going to put some like real garlic powder in it. It will come out. Okay. And some pepper. I'm just going to mix it up. And we're going to put it in this pan and make these muffins. And hopefully this is not a fail, but it probably will be a fail because I did not read and I got the whole eggs instead of egg whites. I only meant to get egg whites. I'm so sad. So I'm about to put these in here. Okay, I'm gonna have to pour it in. So I need my hands. Okay, so here it is. It looks crazy. Um, the spinach, I think I put too much in, so I took some of it out. But we're going to cook these and see how it goes. I feel like this is about to be a major fail, but I'm still going to eat it. I should have gotten egg whites. I thought they were egg whites. So we're going to see how this goes. Okay, so this is my dinner. Um, I just got a shower, so I'm just about to stand up and eat this. But <clears throat> this is a piece of cod that I showed you earlier. And then I have balsamic vinegar right here. And no, I'm just about, I'm just about to eat this standing up because it's really late. And I just want to eat it just to get the nutrients. I'm not being that hungry. So I have my eggs in the oven cooking. But yeah, this is the most basic boring food ever. The cod is good though. Okay, so this is still the same night. I have a bathing suit on because I was taking my before and not after. I'm taking my before picture, but um, I'm really tired. I'm gonna go to bed, but I just want to show you guys these um, muffins I made for breakfast. And uh, I don't wanna show you <clears throat> guys my before picture yet because I, I don't know, I just don't. I want you guys to see it later, but uh, let me show you these. Bam! So I'm gonna see if it tastes good. I'm gonna try one. So it looks like this. So it comes out like this. Mmm. So I'm going to try it.
Mmm. It's actually pretty good. Mmm. That is good. So, in the morning, I'm gonna eat two of these. I'm about to like pack them up now. I'm gonna eat two of those in oatmeal, one fourth cup oatmeal, and with blueberries in it, and that's gonna be my breakfast. Huh? Those are really good, but. <laughs> But yeah, so I took my before picture and video. Um, so I will keep you guys updated about this journey that I'm going on. Hopefully I can win $5,000 because <laughs> I need it so bad. So um, I'll probably post another video next week like as an update and I'll show you guys like other stuff that I'm using to help me. Um, I want to show you guys my scale. I have a really cool like weight scale has like body fat and all that on it uh, i'll show you that next video give you guys an update if i lost any weight blah, blah blah but i'll leave the link to the challenge i am doing below um it's too late to sign up i'm sorry but yeah i didn't really think about vlogging it until like last minute so i hope you guys have a great night or day or whatever you're watching this um let me know what you guys want to see and i'll see you in my next video bye you guys